Church family, welcome uh, to this week's edition of BHC Praise. Bellevue Heights Church is a praying church. And as we pray one for another, we honor God by going to God and taking our cares and concerns to Him. Many of our church family uh, ask us to pray for them, and that's what we're doing. But as we pray for others, we want also to position ourselves before God so that we can know what God desires of us and God hears our prayer. I was reading in the Bible this week a passage from a Psalm chapter 5. Allow me to read verses 8 through 12. Lead me, O Lord, in your righteousness because of my enemies. Make your way straight before me, for there is no truth in their mouth. Their inmost self is destruction. Their throat is an open grave. They flatter with their tongue. Make them bear their guilt, O God. Let them fall by their own counsel. Because of the abundance of their transgressions, cast them out, for they have rebelled against you. But let all who take refuge in you rejoice. That's what I want you to hear. But let all who take refuge in you rejoice. Let them ever sing for joy and spread your protection over them, that those who love your name may exalt you. For you bless the righteous, O Lord. You cover him with favor as a shield. I want to read that last part. But you bless the righteous, O Lord. You cover him with favor as with a shield. As we pray today, let us acknowledge to God that he alone is righteous. He is the righteous one and we are the sinner. Ask God to lead you in righteousness today. Ask God to protect you from any who desire to harm you. And thank God in advance for his provision, for hearing our prayers and answering them according to his will. Join me now as we ask God to, to bless us, as we ask God to hear our prayers, as we give our concerns and prayers to God and trust that he will hear and listen and follow through in the way that is best. Join us now as we pray.
Well, thank you for joining us for this week's edition of BHC Praise. And as I conclude, I return to the, the, the book of Psalms, chapter 5, and I'll read verse 11. It says, But let all who take refuge in you rejoice. Let them ever sing for joy. I want to encourage you as we conclude our prayer time today to take refuge in God. Because when you take refuge in God, you can rejoice, whatever the circumstance, and you can sing for joy. May God bless you today and be encouraged.